Hello and welcome back to Frogboy X1 Gaming. I'm Andrew and today we are checking out Arc Arc Survival Ascended on Xbox Series S. Now this time I am looking at this on a 4K screen. Um, as you know on this channel I have the LG OLED, uh, the LG C2. So this TV has a pretty decent um, upscaler. So let me show you what's going on here. Uh, we're going to go on over here. We're going to jump into the settings real quick. And uh, we're going to go into TV display and options. Okay, so to, in order to make this game look better on your Series S on a 4K screen, you are going to have to drop your resolution to 1080p. You're going to want to hit your refresh rate to 120 hertz. So hopefully your TV has that. If your TV doesn't have that, um, just go ahead and select the 60 frames a second mode. But you also need to come over here to video modes. You need to click on here and you need to make sure allow 4K is not selected. You're not going to be able to utilize HDR while you are gaming with that uh, because you have to take off the 4K. Essentially is what and, and go ahead and leave your VRR on if your if your if your screen does support that you can utilize the low frame rate compensation of the Xbox Series X or S to to smooth out your um, your overall frame frame rate. So this is all very important. Now is what you're doing is you're essentially forcing your Xbox to send a 1080p signal to your 4K TV. And then as what will happen is your 4K TV has a built-in upscaler that will upscale the image to make it look um, significantly better. And yeah, this it does benefit this game. This actually does look pretty decent on a 4K TV. Now it's not going to be super sharp and super crisp because you are working from um, <clears throat> what looks like what appears to be sub 1080p. Like this, this does look sub 1080p but once you get it in there and you let it start upscaling it and doing its thing um it will look very very it, it looks very nice like this looks pretty clean this looks pretty clean on the um on the xbox series s running this on this now you see you notice how like when i turn the pan the camera um it's actually a little bit smooth um in the other video I made, I had a lot of freaking screen tearing in that one. But this one here does not seem to be as bad. Are those mean sharks still out there? Look, they're over there. I don't want to get in that water, man. Those guys are mean to me. Everything on this freaking island is mean to me. Look at all that popping, man. I thought nanite and stuff was supposed to get rid of that stuff. Look at, what is that, a snap jaw? Oh, it's just a big old giant turtle. I don't think these guys are violent, but I can maybe ride him. Let me get on this freaking turtle. Okay, so overall image quality um, is looking very well on this, on the 4K screen. This actually does not look bad at all. I mean, you can definitely tell that it is upscaling from a lower resolution due to, like, the texture quality and stuff. Um, how it just doesn't look like it's got a high texture quality. But if you're looking at this, you know, like, comparing it to, like, say, the PC version, which has the ability to set your texture super high. Um, this actually does not look very... Th this doesn't look terrible compared to that. To be completely honest with you, I just, yeah, even with this, okay, so VRR is working on my screen. Like, I'm not getting the screen tearing now. Okay, so I want to come over here, and I want to climb up that. I want to climb up that. I've seen some mean dinosaurs over here in this area. I'm like, what the freak, man? I just started the game. Now, I don't have a whole lot of experience playing this game. Um, I literally bought this so that I could make content with it because I'm not very good at these uh... Oh man, am I not gonna be able to climb up that? Disappointing Very disappointing I already don't like this game because of that 
already don't like it anymore. See, as you start getting over here, I mean, obviously draw distance is going to be pretty hampered on this. Like, you're not going to be able to see really very far. Oh, man, is that Spinosaurus still over there? Dude, I'm staying away from that guy. He's pretty mean. Actually, there's a lot of mean things out here. I've said that already, though. I think that thing right there came and took me out came and took me out a minute ago too. Like what the freak, man? Like So yeah, once you get into like vegetated areas, let's go this way. Whoa! What the freak, dude? Stupid bird. Why would a bird come after me? Like, what the freak, man? That doesn't even... That's not even freaking funny. But yeah, like, this This is definitely helping with the image quality on this, on this LG... Wow, this actually really doesn't look that bad. Interesting. Tabs. Does Heather look like a meat eater? Okay. I keep watching it. Dude, there's a cliff right there. I don't want to keep running that way. Dang, can't jump up. Yeah, this this actually does look pretty pretty decent on this uh, on this screen being upscaled. <clears throat> you let your TV do your upscaling. Some TVs have very good upscalers, very very good. Um, this is one of them. This LG C2 has a very top notch upscaler, as does my Vizio H1 OLED. So I mean. You can definitely find a suitable image quality for this one. Let's come down this way and see what we got over here. can sneak 
in the grass too. Okay, that wasn't dangerous last time. Oh wait, is that a different one? Let's see, I'll show you real quick. So if we go back over here, <clears throat> let's go to settings, display, put this at 60. Keep that, turn this to video modes, allow 4K. Keep that setting. And then we'll go back over here. We'll put this on 4K. We'll keep that. <clears throat> and then we'll get back into the game. And now it looks significantly worse. Like this thing looks so stretched and so terrible. And now we've got these uh, screen tearing again because now we are running because this is an unlocked frame rate at 60 frames a second so when you have when you have it set to uh, 60 frames a second you're gonna get all the screen tear and because you're not getting like that full range of VRR that will help you with the low frame rate compensation like this just looks terrible when when you don't have it set to 1080p like you can literally see the the terrible fuzz all over in that grass now it just looks horrendous like look at the trees in the distance they look like they're pixelated now in terms of like having uh like film grain or something now just keep your eyes trained back there on the on those uh on those trees we're gonna do this one more time we're gonna come into here Go into our settings again. Video modes, we're going to disable 4K. We're going to go back out here. We're going to okay, we're going to keep that at 1080p and then we're going to put it back on 120 FPS mode. And then we're going to get back into the game. And now look, everything looks nicer. Everything looks sharper. It looks cleaner. And you're not getting that annoying f screen tearing anymore that we were getting before. Your image quality looks sharper, cleaner. It doesn't look all fuzzy anymore. It actually looks nicer and a lot cleaner than it did before. If you look over at those trees, they look a lot nicer. And the grass around you looks cleaner as well. It's not all fuzzy like it was without without the uh, without the TV's upscaler. So, all right, my friends, if you like this content, don't forget to like and subscribe. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you for watching.